welcome back one and all to the Brexit estate, hard by the darkest dungeon where we are in a bit of a pickle. Now, if you remember, just one moment, yep, that's all good. If you remember last time, we had a rather unfortunate incident in the Crimson Courtyard, where both Wenger Felgren and Vernon perished. So we're down a man at arms, down a jester. But that's not all. Because upon returning to town, we had only four vials of blood remaining. So we need to go on a blood run. Unfortunately, our available blood run this week is a level five quest and we only have one level five heroine and she's not up to the task alone. Which means we can't go on a blood run. So the next most important thing to establish is how many of our heroes are wasting away and will perish should they not achieve a bottle of blood in the near future. So we have a Stella, that makes one. Fennel, that makes two. Shamara makes three. Gwyn makes four. And Sophie makes five. And Lavinia makes six. Well, we've only got four vials in town, which means probably two people are going to die. Unless we have some very nice trinkets, which we probably don't have. No. So. We don't have enough blood to go round, and we can't do a blood run. And if if heroes are going to die anyway, I might as well go for the Baron and take those heroes and find out what his fight is like. And take as many wasting heroes as possible, which is a terribly dumb thing to do. But it seems as if it's our only option, really. Oh. This is going to be really dumb, isn't it? So let's look at this. Gwyn, you deserve it. Go on, get in there. We want to take Estella and Shamara, obviously, because they started this quest. So who goes in third place? I'm thinking someone like a grave robber, but not like a grave robber if it's our only one. Hakeem... I don't know, see, I, I have this feeling that we're going to get pulled about and repositioned a lot because the developers seem to love shuffle parties at the moment. Ah... Uh, let's see... And of course the question is... Oh, Sophie. Right, yeah, we have... Could do a lot of Leap of Faith. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting, actually. Uh, hmm. I can reach free, free. This party would have problems reaching rank four reliably, so I'd have to go throwing daggers and switch these around a bit. Actually, what's what class is this for? The, um, where is it? The Jester, of course. Alright. Well, who do we want to round this party out? Um, some kind of shooty character, actually. Um, I would not send our musketeer in there. We don't have an arbalist. Well. Oh, that's a death sentence, isn't it? Great. What can a fla flagellant do from rank 3? The thing is, this doesn't have to be all people with the Crimson Curse at this point. As long as we're taking like these three in, we're good. In theory. Actually, we could... Hmm. 
Hmm. I could take one less. Having no idea what to expect does not... You know what? We could take our witch. She's not even wasting away. Right, since we're going for the Baron, and it's a relatively short distance to go, let's look at some skill upgrades. This is going to be a suicidal run, it's going to be tragic, it's going to be terrible, I'm just hoping people survive. I'm looking at skills now to see if there's anything I want to increase. Oh yes, yes there is. Um, I don't know middle <laughs> rank's going to be worth it quite so much. But let's grab these. Mm. Yeah, just just bundling stuff in here, getting loads of skill upgrades. Right. Blood curse, basilisk's curse, max them out. Why can't I? Oh, this is weird. Yeah, something weird has gone on here. Uh, it requires like. It, I think it's something in the in the skill training file that for some reason it requires the wrong skill. Which is just really weird. Right. Um uh, show sure, right, yeah. Okay, we'll put that up to the free and leave it there. And we're really low on money now. Well that's okay, because we're sending these characters off to their doom with a twilight cloak and a founding stone. That is really, really bad. Um, what does Ren have? Ren has... Okay, yeah. The Twilight Cloak already. Okay. Oh, this is going to be a total disaster, isn't it? Well, here we go then. Is there anything I can... Yeah, look at this. There's two of these. No arbalist in sight. Uh, sell one of these. And one of those. Those are quite good on the whole. And then nip back to here because we've got room for a couple more heroes. And while there's not much here worth taking, this is a worthy jester. Um, Golden Groucho, for obvious reasons. Yeah. We'll take him on and hope you we get will be laughing still at the end. Hope we get a good rank two character, preferably a man at arms or an arbalist. So the goal here is to try to defeat the Baron. Hope nobody dies. Oh my god. Um, okay, that's really bad then. In that case, there's just not enough blood, is there? Right. You just don't have the... Okay, so Lavinia. Sophie. You know... Away as well. Oh, this is insane. <sighs> if only we could bring her along with us. So that's three characters in town wasting. It's just going to be a bloodbath. It's going to be horrible. Um, not a lot I can do about it, really. Just a lucky dip. Oh, wait. Okay, that's literally going to be it. I know there's not enough blood in the estate. I'm not taking it with me. I don't have any choice. When you give me uh, an unobtainable blood run that's for level 5 heroes and I just can't do it. I just can't do it, you know? It is sadly what it is. 
The good news is that we do not need to come back away from this room. Okay, let's light a torch and pray. This is probably going to be a very short run. We don't have any. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh great, two afflicted as well. Well, hopefully this is it. The moment of truth. <sighs> okay. Those are okay for a boss fight. Um, yeah. Yes. I mean, that's a fairly standard Vestal setup. On average, let's see how badly this goes. Probably gonna lose some really good trinkets here. Let the disaster commence. It's probably not even this room, it's probably just another blooming hallway. Oh, you absolute bastards. So, my supposition that this was not the destination was correct. So this is going to be even more disastrous than I believed. Alright. Just keep working at it. And maybe, just maybe, we shall endure this torment. Hopefully with minimal losses. Well, that's interesting. Just bleed some more. Okay, dodge it all. Fine. Just give me some blood after this fight, please. It is much needed. Well, I think we know what's coming here. A one, two. Here's the one. And here's the two. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Alright, we're kind of back in position and ready to resume hostilities. Please, nobody die from blood loss just walking around here. Thunder Vestal! Does damage as well, okay. And sounds vaguely vague. Wait a minute, bleeding. Oh, I don't have Sin Leech ready. Oh. Mortality well, that's just in a tragic. single strike. Continue the onslaught. <laughs> Destroy them all. You're tragic. We're working on a lot of stress here. A lot of red flies around people's heads. And that is a lot of blood. So let's just fix that up a bit. Okay. That's okay. That's not okay. <laughs> Ow. Everybody's stressed out, Gwyn. Do your stuff. There'd better be like one vial of blood here. There won't be, but it would be nice if there was. Right. Flesh curse. There we go. She's our only witch, so if she perishes, it's not quite so bad. And that is six points. That's a lot. Oh, 12 is. No, I mean 11. 11's a good counter to that. And I believe. Okay, let's just get some stress off people. And this is okay. 
I mean, yeah, all right. Dealing with it. They're doing the best they can, poor little things. Right, stuff it. Give her the stress. All the stress. Oh, this is really rough. <laughs> Got her down to a hundred. Their formation is broken. Maintain blood. Blood! Defensive. Okay, the first blood was before I saw it. The second blood was after. Who needs it the most? One of these three. Um, she's carrying... Well, look. She's our first Twilight Knight. I think she's... Let's look at the traits. Nothing locked. Nothing locked. Nothing locked. Okay. It's gonna be you, my dear. Oh no! <laughs> it just keeps on getting bigger and bigger and bigger and not getting there. Okay! And back in town, people are dying because they don't have enough blood in them. Well, they don't have enough. Somebody More else's blood soaks the soil. Blood in them. Feeding the evil therein. Fucking money. Probably head back to town before it gets much worse, cause that was our only hellion. Oh no! More dust, more ashes, more disappointment. Okay, we're going back. What a disaster! What an absolute disaster! I didn't have much choice in the matter. There'd better be a lower level blood group quest this time. Just Do shocking. Not ruminate on this fleeting failure. The campaign is long, and victory will come. <laughs> Morbid entertainment indeed. Oh, really? I'm not surprised. Ah! Oh. Eldritch Hater replaced Irrepressible, but they're both good! Damn. <sighs> How many people In died? Time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. Nobody? It's controlled, controlled, drank. Nobody died from lack of blood, except we do now have a shockingly low hero count. Great. Just great. Um, no experienced heroes this week either. Gonna have to try and get that level 3 weaponsmith soon. Without trading... Right. Blood quest. Level 3 blood quest. It shall be done. Okay. What a short week. What a short excursion into the dungeon. And poor Estella and Shamara perish due to lack of blood. And I don't just mean bleeding wounds. They were just like total addicts. That's very disappointing and quite saddening. Oh well, I uh, I hope you didn't all completely dislike this episode, and I'll see you all in the next one. Right, bye for now.